Okay, thank you very much uh, for that question. I, I think, uh, first of all, uh, not many people know about these SDGs. Not many people know about SDG 2, achieving zero hunger. So uh, it's limited to very few people who are aware about it, but the solution actually needs a much wider population that has to understand uh, what is about hunger. And uh, also many, not many people understand what hunger is or what famine is. And uh, that has not been like properly defined in the current context. And this has to be done in, in a way that, uh, okay, we are talking of goals, but then we haven't defined the problem and make this known to everybody so that at the end of the day, they are part of the solution of this uh, SDG uh, goal. So challenges, lack of information, lack of data, uh, uh, what, what, where, it, where it is, where, what, who is affected, and to what extent, uh, what age category is much affected. So that kind of uh, misinformation actually would not help us really achieve the SDG 2. I guess that is a, one of the major challenges that I see. If we don't have information, then there's no point, there's no way that we'll be able to, to achieve. Um, what should be done, probably, I would say, um, we need information out there as to what are the issues. We need data that can actually be reflecting what is happening as far as hunger is concerned. So lack of information to me is a challenge, but what can be done in, uh, in this time that we have, I think to build capacity of uh, people to be able to collect um, good data to really inform us as to what is happening as far as hunger is concerned. But then we need involvement of everybody. Uh, you know, these uh, SDGs are discussed at a much higher level. Uh, one way to really be able to even achieve part of what we are seeing as a target, I think should be to get information back to the local people, the people who are really affected. Because we discuss this as a much higher level and we forget about the people who are actually affected. H how can we make them aware? And I'm sure once they are made aware, they would come up with their own kind of solutions. And we, do, we cannot come with a blanket solution like global or uh, country solution because these hunger challenges are unique in every society, every community. So how can we build capacity for these communities to be able to identify? So we need to build capacity of communities to be able to identify the challenges and therefore come up with local solutions that can be implemented right there. But if I say like we can come up with a solution at global level, that would be just guidance, but solutions should actually come from the people who are affected.